put up in my Xenon today to test out my new uh, GPS and uh, iPad configuration and my ADS-B system. You can see the view is still great, not much uh, blocked view. Uh, Xenon has awesome windows. Uh, the new iFly GPS is uh, just above my left knee there, and my uh, regular iPad also displaying the iFly programs up above that. You can see I'm flying pretty much hands-off here. The Xenon uh, doesn't really need much control and uh, not much stick shake uh, while you're flying. Either the iPad or the iFly can display uh, any combination of things. Here's a full map mode. You see lots of instruments there. Uh, you can put any combination of instruments. The blocks can be any size you want. You can put them anywhere on the screen you want. It's completely customizable. Here's a synthetic vision screen again with uh, different instruments and uh, altitude and speed tapes. Here's a combination of a split screen, uh, synthetic vision on the left, uh, a map mode on the right, and in the middle there was a little radar display which is, shows the ADS-B targets and the ADS-B targets also show up in the synthetic vision or on the map mode. Here's the full map mode again. Uh, you see a number of instruments uh, in the upper center. You see a small synthetic vision screen. Uh, in the very bottom center you see a vertical profile of the flight plan. You see we have to go over some mountains there. Uh, then the bottom has some soft keys uh, for various other uh, functions of the uh, program. And then uh, lastly, you see the uh, block uh, of the airport information. If you touch anywhere on the screen, it'll give you information as of that spot. So I've touched the airport, and you see the, uh, the full uh, airport information, runway information, communications information including uh, which runway is currently favored and how much of a crosswind I will have on that runway. I'm really happy with this setup. Uh, by including my iPad, I have a full uh, duplicate screen. Of course, the iPad has its own GPS. It's getting information from the ADSB, but it also uh, can pick up cell phone signals and get current weather information that way and uh, the combination gives me a complete backup. And uh, one thing I like so much about the iFly program is that uh, the blocks and the text are very large, which I couldn't find in any other program. And in uh, a bouncy gyroplane cockpit, the uh, extra large text blocks seem to really uh, pay for themselves. So I'm really happy with this system. It's a great way to go flying.